Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. On this week's vlog, I had something a little bit different I wanted to do. The colors I used this week. Let's get started. So a few of the colors that I used this week, let's just kind of start by brand. So we'll go into the Beamy Beauty Box first. I used two of my favorite colors, R02 and R06 from the Red Collection from AR Nail Supply. I will be repurchasing these. I rarely repurchase because I have such a big collection, but there are a few that I really love to have on hand, and truly this entire Red Collection, I'm wearing this one, and I love it so, so much. The next brand that I used a couple out of is going to be the Lacket, and I used Vixen and Marvelous. I really like these two. They're really great fall colors. They're both really good for full coverage too. I do keep like one row of the locket still. You can kind of see the end of the row right there. And people do love them and I love them. It's just, I'm running out of space. <laughs> so the next brand I used of course is Glitter Bells and I have two, four, six of the Unbelievable Gels and two, four, five, six of the gel polishes. Some of these I used multiple times because you know how that is, right? Like even the red that I'm wearing, people will come in and they were like, I was thinking either red or black, but now that I've seen that, I'm definitely going with red. Or now that I've seen that, I've definitely go with black. That's another thing that leads me to, I used black, of course, and white. I always use those. Those are staples in my collection. I have a lot of clients that wear black, of course, year round. I really don't see a problem with that. I, some people are like, can I wear black in the summer? I'm like, you can wear black anytime. Let's carry on. So the unbelievable gels in no particular order are indestructible. I love this one. These like indestructible. So some of these I used together, like five separate colors of the warm, what I consider to be sweater color. So Indestructible was one of them. I also used Flawless as a base for some ghost nail art, so it's pink. It was really sweet when we were done. We used Retro, and it is another one of the warm sweater colors. They look really great in matte. They also look really great in shiny. We used Manifest in that same five, but I also used that a couple times on its own. Bold Babe, because why wouldn't you use that? It's the most beautiful neutral brown, and it's so hot. I also used Milky shimmer because I feel like I use that at least three times a week. I love it so much. In my Glitter Bells gel polish line, I also used Cappuccino and Mantra warm sweater colors. I used Crazy Cat Lady and Burgundy Spice, which probably are two of my most used colors in the fall, winter, clear throughout the cold Canadian season. And very tastic because it's so pretty. It's kind of a burgundy, but for those that don't want to commit to dark burgundy. I also used, I'm realizing there's one that's missing out of this, and I thought I pulled it. It's right here. This one I have had for two years now, and people are just draining it this year. Last year they didn't want it. This year they're all about it, and it's sweet syrup. Those are a collection of the colors I used this week. If you want to see something like that again, let me know down below. I just thought it would be kind of fun, and it would be something... I don't know, it's fun to see what colors other people's clients are liking and using.